Hey guys, welcome to another computer graphics tutorial. Today we'll be learning about HSV color model. So let's get started. First thing, if you don't know what RGB color model is, I have made a video on that. You need to learn that first to understand this concept. All right. So if you know what RGB color model is, this is our RGB color cube. We have got red, green and blue over here. And if we look at this cube from this angle, then it will look like a hexagon like this. All right. Now, how did we get this yellow, magenta, sign, all these colors? So basically what we did is we added green and red to get yellow. We added sign and uh, sorry, we added blue and red to get magenta. And finally, we added blue and green to get sign. So let's see how it works. Basically, what we do is first we'll add the values. That is, we'll add red plus green. All right, so both values are full, that is one, or you can say 255 into 56 bit model, you get yellow. All right, so yellow is 255, 255 because red is there, green is there, but blue is not there. All right, so this is yellow 255, 255, 0. Now the next color we'll create or we'll find out is blue plus green. All right, so what we'll do is We'll take red as 0 and green as 255 and blue as 255. You can see over here what we get. We get magenta. Sorry, sine. All right. So sine is red is 0 and blue is 255 and green is 255. So 0, 255, 255. All right, now we have got our sign color. Now we'll add red and blue. Okay, so let's add red equal to 255, green equal to zero, because there is no green, and blue equal to 255. We get our magenta. So we write it as magenta 255, comma, zero, comma, 255. All right, so this is known as CMYK color model that is sign, magenta, yellow and K. K is the value of the brightness. All right, so hence we have written the white that is we have got all the three colors in white that is red, green and blue. We get white. So hence it is 255, 255, 255. K means the brightness value which is also known as white or black. All right. So this is how we get CMYK model from RGB. Now, what does this CMYK model has to do with our HSV model? All right. So we'll look at it. First thing is what each, what is HSV color model? HSV color model has three main components. That is hue, saturation and value. We'll look at each components separately. All right. So first question is what is hue? Hue represents the angle with the vertical axis all the six colors which we covered just now, that is red, green, blue, cyan, magenta, yellow, all these six colors have different different angles in that hexagon, all right? And they are separated each by 60 degrees. So let's look at it over here. Let's say we start from zero at red and at 360 again we get red. So we get yellow at 60, green at 120, cyan at 180, 240, then 300 and 360. All right. So this is U, the angle at which the color is. All right. So for red, we write it as zero, yellow as 60 and so on. So it represents the angle with the vertical axis. Remember, U represents the angle, not the vertical axis. It represents the vertical angle. It represents the angle with the vertical axis. All right. Now let's look at what is saturation. Now we know what U is now we look at saturation. Saturation means the purity of the color. All right. So let's look at this hexagon from the side, this side. So it will look somewhat like this tilted side. All right. Now you look at this, the angle defines hue, but the vertical axis over here. All right. This vertical axis defines the saturation. All right. Now we are looking at it sideways since you can look at it as a vertical axis. All right. So this vertical axis saturation decides the purity of the color. 
all right so purity of the u now saturation represents ratio of purity of the u and it ranges from 0 to 1 all right so how much pure it is so if it is let's say the saturation is 1 and the angle is 0 that is u is 0 then we get a pure red color all right if the saturation is say 0 0.25 and the angle is yellow so we have got a quarter of a ratio of a pure yellow color all right if we have angle 120 and the saturation is zero what does that mean it is a black color because no matter what if the saturation is zero it means it's in gray scale that is black all right so this is what saturation is now let's look at value that is the third component of hsv color model now value v varies from zero to one and it decides the brightness of the color model same like our cmyk color model v represents the value of the brightness okay so v equal to zero over here it represents black whereas v equal to one it represents white all right now the top surface of this hexagon over here it represents all the pure u color okay so this is the pure red this is pure yellow this is pure green this is pure magenta this is pure blue this is pure sign and at the center over here this is white color that is it has saturation equal to zero okay it has value equal to one and all the other colors that are pure all right so white is 255 comma 255 comma 255 in hsv model v is one saturation is zero okay and what else is there hue hue is let's say there is no angle over here for this all right so this is what value is it represents the brightness of the color all right so the higher you go the more brighter the color the lower you come the less brighter the color all right so let's do the revision over here what is u u is the angle with the vertical axis of this hexagon for example red is at 0 degrees yellow is at 60 degrees green is at 120 degrees magenta is at 180 degrees blue is at 240 degrees and cyan is at 300 degrees all right so this angle representation is u now the next thing is saturation saturation is the vertical axis that represents the purity of the hue all right and it ranges from 0 to 1 it represents the ratio of purity of color so let's say saturation value is 1 and we have got the u angle as let's say 60 degrees then we have got a pure yellow color or u angle is 120 and saturation is 1 then we have got a pure green color all right so this is what saturation means it represents the ratio of purity of the color and finally comes the value value represents the brightness of the color okay and it ranges from 0 to 1 and the 0 v equal to 0 means it is a black color and v equal to 1 means it is a white color all right so these is what hsv color model is if you have any doubt feel free to ask them in the comment section below if i have made any mistakes please let me know if you like this video then only subscribe and if you have any request please write them in the comment section below thank you very much so that's it for today guys thank you very much for watching if you have any queries feel free to ask them in the comment section below if you have any suggestions please write them in the comment section below if you like the video please share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.